What's going on guys? Just wanted to do a little bit of an update video for the OHMM 2017. Things have changed since the initial video and I just wanted to make sure that I was getting a video out to you guys to know what's been going on. So first and foremost, we are no longer gonna meet in Laurelville. We have moved the meet spot to Logan, Ohio, to the Hocking Mall Shopping Center. I wanted to accommodate a much bigger spot because the original spot was a, a much smaller parking lot and with the uh, recent changes in events, we seem to have a lot more people coming, so I wanted to make sure that the parking lot was more than big enough. The route will still be the exact same, but we're just going to start at a different spot, and then we're going to finish, hopefully, at Millstone Barbecue. I still have to call them and finalize those details, but the idea is to stop at Millstone Barbecue at the end of the ride for some dinner. Iron Pony, if you guys have never been there, out of just outside of Columbus, Ohio. Awesome, 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 awesome motorcycle store. They have agreed to sponsor some free giveaway stuff that we will be giving away some gift cards. They did not specify the amount as of now, so I can't give you that information, but there will be at least three gift cards to be given away. There will also be some other industry swag and stickers and things like that to be given away as well. If you want to be able to be eligible too for the giveaway, visit the Facebook event page. RSVP, say you're going to attend. We need to know that because Iron Pony has also agreed to give every single attendee a t-shirt. Once you RSVP for the event, there is a flyer. Take that image, save it, and repost it, reshare it out to your social media. Make sure it's the flyer that includes the Iron Pony logo on it. And the only reason I say that is because that has the updated meat spot. Once you share that, make sure you hashtag OHMM. 2017 so that way we can verify that you've shared the video out or shared the flyer out when we go to do the giveaway there are some big motor vloggers going to be attending i think we're almost up to 80 people rsvp at this point either they're interested or they are going we have some big motor vloggers b rad says he's going to be attending 650 eve also planning to attend both those guys are well over 100k subs so it'll be a good opportunity to meet those guys to network with those guys etc. Lastly, I can't reiterate enough, make sure you guys RSVP on the Facebook page to let them know that you're either interested or going, so that way I can let Iron Pony know how many t-shirts to get me in advance. I'm not going to take extra t-shirts because it's kind of a hassle to be able to bring all this stuff down because I'm trying to take the motorcycle too. If you don't RSVP for the event and we run out of shirts, the people who RSVP'd are going to be the first persons to receive them. So. Just make sure you go there, RSVP. If you know you're going to come with a couple extras, let me know in the com in the post section. Just say, hey, you know, a couple of my buddies are going to come. They're not going to RSVP, but there's three extra guys, and I'll try to get three extra T-shirts. I've got a lot of the Toledo and Akron crew coming down with me. I'm going to set up with them to be blockers and things like that so nobody else will have to worry about that. Just remember, guys, there's going to be a lot of people here. It's not a ride where we want to show off how big our units are. It's just going to be a very mild-paced ride, just kind of get together. The main point is just getting everyone together and uh, network each other and just kind of get to know other, other vloggers around that kind of share the same passion of both motorcycling and videoing for YouTube. If you are not a video producer, content creator, Instagrammer, you're still more than welcome to show up. You don't even need a bike if you just want to come and show up to the meet and meet some of your these guys. I'm oh, okay. Yeah. What? You stalled? Yeah. That's alright. That'll be it for the video. <laughs> I thought you were going to stop longer so I hit put my foot down and all of a sudden you took over like, oh shit. Nope. Game over. I'm unpredictable. What a rookie move again. Iron Pony, I love you guys, thank you. I appreciate it, you guys are the best. Uh -huh. Two more things guys. One is, make sure you guys pay attention to the Facebook event because I will update everything up to the last minute on that page. So if for some reason there's adverse weather, uh, we'll still probably hold the event, but it, there, you know, we'll obviously cancel the ride portion of it, but we'll still meet up, we'll still get dinner. You can still come out and meet these guys. We'll still do the giveaway. All that will still go on even if we do have adverse weather conditions. Most importantly is if it's raining and it's thunderstorming, these roads are very unforgiving. We're not going to risk people getting hurt in order just to kind of do a ride when it's kind of pointless. But the event will still go on regardless of the weather. So make your plans. Pay attention to the event. 
Facebook page. If things change or anything updates, I will update it there 100%. So just make sure you guys stay up to date with that. And then obviously, if you're gonna head down, just visit the event page before you go and make sure nothing's drastically changed, which shouldn't. I've made these changes to accommodate pretty much anything that needs to happen. Maybe if you wanted to know the full itinerary, I'll update it there as well. Uh, I will be doing the giveaway regardless of what happens the day of the event. And you have to be present if you wanna win the gift. It's, it, Iron Pony donated the gift cards specifically for the event. So if you do show up to the event, you will be eligible, but if you don't show up, your name will not be entered. Uh, what I'll probably end up doing is I'll probably bring like sticky notes to the event. If you've shared the event and, and you can show me that you've shared the event and you've RSVP'd, I'll give you a sticky note. You'll be able to write your name, enter it into the hat, and then that way we'll have everyone who's at the event eligible for it. I think that'll work out the best. I agree. I will bring some name tag stickers, like hi, my name is, if you want to put oh, your God. YouTube channel. If you're a moto vlogger or a content creator that does not like to show their face, Please make appropriate accommodations to hide your face somehow. Do not force every single vlogger to, you know, to remember whose face needs to be blurred out. Wear a mask, wear your helmet the entire time. If you want to tell people to blur your face, that's fine. Hopefully they listen. But if they don't, I don't want you to be up in arms because somebody forgot to blur your face. You need to make the appropriate uh, steps to make sure that that doesn't happen. But that's pretty much all I have for the update video for you guys. Again, don't forget to RSVP, share the flyer, get it out there. This event's going to be a lot bigger than a previously uh, anticipated, which is exciting because getting more people together just helps us grow. But that's all I have for you guys. Thanks for watching the video if you're still here. If you're out there riding, remember to stay safe. Always to enjoy the moment, keep that rubber side down. And until the next video, from your boy Throttlecock TV, Mr. Royalty and not wheeling. We'll catch you guys later. Oh, we got a dab and a pop in the balloons.